Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another SEC showdown. We got Auburn University once again. I love playing Auburn. I think they're a great school. Um, even though I went to Clemson and I love Clemson, I can't sit there and say that Auburn's not a good program. Because they are. They always generate a good program. Always good competition for Bama. And that kick six a couple years ago, man, I I walked in the door as I got off work and I saw Chris Davis returning to 109 yards for a touchdown. So if any of y'all are Auburn fans, much love, much respect. Let's go ahead and, oh Lord, let's go ahead and take a look at some of our recruiting. Recruiting is always intriguing. I think it's the best part of the game. It's the hardest part of the game for me. Some of y'all are recruiting gurus. I am not. But I'm steadily getting better. Okay, Kenneth Williams. We're fourth on his board. I have offered no scholarship, so I'm kind of impressed that we are where we are. Wallace Carrington has us first. He's visiting week 12. Bruh. No, bruh. We're, we're ways out. <laughs> All right, and of course, uh, Eddie Cannon. He's got Clemson first. Clemson's probably going to take the dude. Mike Foreman, we're in the lead. That's very surprising. I would figure he would want to go to a higher rated school, but oh well, some guys are different. Josh Andrews, we are third, surprisingly. And Chris Brown, we're second, number one corner in the nation. Hopefully we can slowly move up. Rashawn Maynard, I really don't expect to get some of these dudes. I know it's like uh, in a perfect world, I could land all of them, but that's not really realistic. That's We're going for more of a sim here. David Colvin, 7th. Colt Williams, 5th. And the punter, we are 3rd, but Pitt is pulling ahead. I don't know why. Turd Nuggets are not looking at our program. I guess we got to just keep winning. So we're playing Auburn at Auburn. Let go. Especially important any All right, so we're going up against a staunch line here. Really cool See what we got. Of course, I'm going to run it up the middle. I don't think he's going to have much of a problem with blocking them. There you go. Miles Washington. First off, we need to calm this crowd down. Need to make them think a little bit. Nick Johnson, Juco transfer. I think he's had a great year. See what he can do. Oh, yeah. Well, what in the world? And change that run. And he makes it out to about the forty-one. Ah, come on, boys! All right, so getting good chunks of yardage out of the run game. So I'm impressed with my run game so far. Let's see what we can do passing. Quick throw out to the receiver. Jackson, dude, this dude. First down. See now the key to beating SEC defenses. Is when they do stuff like this, they bring down the safety and you pop a screen at them. See what happens here. Screen pass. He's got his half back. There we go. All right, so double a gap blitz. I'm gonna change up that blocking scheme. I'm keeping your defense on the field, buddy. Ah, oh, Jennings, you gotta get that block. All right, so big third down. Obviously very important. See what we got here. There we go, Cavius. Hold on to that ball. Three of three, 29. That's what we got out of Malik so far on the first drive. He's warming up, baby. He's warming up. Ah, no yards. I got a blitz coming. I'm going to have to pull Pod potentially go underneath the Justin Johnson. Ball. Inside the 10. Yeah. The oh. 28. That a kid. That's Brumfield, man, the senior. Just nice Look at that. That's that's in there, man. The fact that he caught it. Even more impressive. Alright, you know I'm bringing out my hog mollies. You know, I love my guys. Change my blocking scheme. That left tackle of mine is always tired. There you go. He gets set. 
down. Oh, come on. Second down. They're crowding the line. We took up, like, pretty much the whole first quarter. I got a feeling Auburn is going to do what you call it, hurry up on their offense. So we got to score. There we go, Miles. Touchdown for the senior. Atta kid. This kid is a really reliable weapon. You definitely want the Always a noisy place to play. All right, let's see what we got. Justin Johnson outright. There you go, Wayne Jackson. Little. Ooh, they are not playing off, are they? See if we can play this. Dang, that was a hit and a half. Games come on strong. Run game kind of falling off. See what we got. There you go, Brumfield. Good catch, good ball. All right, got my little verts play. See who gets open. There you go. Antoine Dixon waiting. The 29 yard line. It's second down. All right, got to make the right read. Everybody gets set. Johnson cutting across. Let's see what we got. There you go, Antoine Dixon. 16. Saw that open right there. Well, bang. Good ball. Kent State. Holds a four-point lead. So Flynn and Johnson. Okay. Here they come. He'll take it himself. There we go. Give me that first down. Good job, Malik. You just don't see this very often anymore in college football. They come out in a goal line. My boys are super tired. Gonna let this clock burn. All right. Bro, get set. Oh, that's easy. That's blocking all day. Good job, Miles. Touchdown number two for the senior. That gives him another touchdown to go along with the one he's... We'll take it. That was just an excellent... Hit him with that play action, though. Good catch, Bowen. Right away. Everything about that play was crisp. The route, the throw, the catch. That's fun to see. Here's the 11th play of the drive. They coming out. Yep, they're coming. They're giving me coverage. I want. Let's see what we got. And he tackles him. Good job, Johnson. 14 yards. First and ten. Ball on the 15. 267. Oh, Will Matthews running them over for 13. Well, they can't get this offense off the field. Not a kid. Machine on this drive, very methodical and efficient, and once again, they're moving the chains. And this is the 13th play of this drive. Let's go, let's go. All the big boys are on the field now. Both teams have their big sets out. See, we got the hog mollies. Let's go. Touchdown. Touchdown number three. We'll take it. I don't care if he's got 18 yards on the game and three touchdowns. We'll take it. It's his third trip to the end zone. Boy, this guy's been huge today. It's been a big part of the reason that his team has the lead. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Adams has the ball set, and he looks ready to kick this one deep. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Mitchell's poised right now, Kirk, here in the third quarter. He's such a solid player. I mean, he's everything we expected and then some, I think. 
The one word that comes to mind with this young man is just consistency. I mean, he, he seems to be able to go out here in almost every single series. He gives his off hey, come on. chance to be able to have a drive. Yeah, you want to run that ball. And eventually put points up on the board. Ah, throw it out. There you go. Today for this defense to be able to try to contain. It's second and ten. Ball on the 25. By 22, by 22. Let's go. Throws complete. He's got space to get him out. There we go. Around the 40 yard line. Good pitch and catch there on second down. Yep. It was good enough to get him the first down. That's just a nice play. And it looks like they're going to run away with this one as we head into the fourth quarter. Kent State's got a huge lead. Well, folks, we resume action. All right, we're still playing well. For some action, so See what we got. One. Please run this ball. Oh, red 18! Red 18! <laughs> what? I just hit-sticked him, and he just shrugged it off. All right. From the 34 yard line. First down. Let's see, what do you got for me? There we go. That was definitely a face mask, but oh well. Gains about two yards on the run. Makes it second and eight. Let's go, boys. Oh, somebody make the tackle. Thank you. To about the 15. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 15-yard line. Don't let him drag you. Come on, you got to get him in the backfield. Running back, and that'll get him seven, maybe eight yards. I'm blitzing linebacker every play. Touchdown. And of course he gets it. That's ridiculous. So the halfback took it in for six. Simple play call there by the offensive coordinator. Just give it to the back and let him find his way into the end zone. And he tacks on the extra point. Let's throw it out to Reese now for a studio update. Time to check in in College Station. And for Arkansas, a very lethargic performance so far. If they don't watch out, they're going to be in a world of hurt. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. You know, they practiced all week this week, and they told us yesterday, Brad, that they felt pretty good about what they put in, the plan that they had. And I think now that you see them playing today, it's no wonder they felt so good. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense got a weird blitz coming. Step it up and make a stop. Halfback's got it on the quick throw. He's to the 40. Let's go. Huge screen. Loving it. 34 yards. Throwing for over 300 in the day. Followed my blocking. That was excellent upfield blocking. Just fast enough to get it. So after the big pass play, we've got a first down. Let's see if I can get the right blocking scheme. Brought down right around the four. Come on, that nose tackle's killing it. That brings up second and nine. That number three dude, he's crushing me. Brought down after 
There you go, Nick Johnson. Get us six. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. See what we got. There we go. First down. Good job, Miles. Nice run by the tailback. Not a lot of razzle dazzle here, but it gets the job done and picks up the first down. See what we can do here. Tackle made right around the 30. Nothing. That makes it second and ten. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 30. Has run for three touchdowns, so I can't be too upset. We're gonna hit him with these verts. Terrible throw. By the defense, he can't hold it. Hey, that's a heads up play there by the defender. Get those hands up and something good may just happen. Empty backfield, quarterback. Taking our time. Let's see what we got. Wide out makes the first. There you go, Justin Johnson. And for Johnson. That's another catch in that. He's over 100. Not a kid. I think the quarterback and this receiver right now are clearly in the zone. The defense needs to do a better job of adjusting their defense to be able to slow him down. He now has over 100 yards receiving in this game. And this is the eighth play of the drive. See what Nick Johnson and crew can do. No, good Lord. Crushed. Two yards with a carry. 63, you're running away from you guy. From the 13-yard line, it's second down. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Oh, Lord. Uh. Well, that one stunk it up. This is the tenth play of this drive. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. The five, and it's caught. Touchdown. Touchdown number two. Knew they had a star quarterback. He came through for him in the clutch. Justin Johnson killing it. Quarterback is. In fact, that's why they decided to try to get as much pressure on him as they could. They weren't able to get home, leaving him plenty of time to make the throw, and he delivered when he needed to. And he converts the extra point. Reese Davis is standing by with this update. Reese. Adams ready to kick. Davis back to return. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Brad, this is my kind of game. I love seeing this kind of production and the way these quarterbacks are playing. Both teams are challenging both of these defenses. All right, got it. I know I got a pass coming. They got to start passing 42 to 17. It's been a brutal game. There we go. Get that tackle. At the 28 yard line. From their own 28 yard line. Second down. Here we go. Is he going to stay in pass protection? Yep. Nope. Incomplete. He can't pull it in. Number three, the intended receiver on the play. That makes it third and seven. Man left, man left. Bringing the blitz on him. Both my linebackers. A little over a minute. In the Please game. throw the screen. Nah, Carlos Pickett on the hit. Okay. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. First and 10. Ball on their own 41. See, what do we have here? Yeah. And 
I whiffed again. If you're trying to make it respectable, it's not working. No, oh, I was on that tight end. Come on, give it. He sails it long. Oh, missed it. Davis burned us. All the way home. Touchdown. The wide out here truly knows what he has to do to contribute to make his team successful. Of course, the last like minute of the game lasts like 10 minutes. A six play, 74 yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, I love these kind of drives. They're old school, grind it out and earn the yards and just rip the heart right out of that defense. He's taken down at the 45. The Golden Flash coaching staff stuck to their game plan. It works. Yeah, give him a lot of credit for coming up with a plan where they knew they could find ways to get him the football, even with all the recognition and defense being concerned about him. They came up with that plan and this young man delivered. Come out in five wide just to play with them. The results of the last one, which ended in a touchdown. Well, it's one thing to have speed. It's another thing to have an idea of what you're doing and how to attack the defense. 70 yards for my dude. Receivers clearly have done an outstanding job in being able to make their reads and getting out of their breaks, and the quarterback put the ball right on the money. We're going to take a knee, and we're going to walk out of here with the dub. as they just try to kill the clock. You'll go down to one knee. There we go. That's all she wrote. Mitchell's performance, one for the books. We expected it to be great, and it was. Isn't it fun when you know... Give it to Mitchell. Three weeks in a row, boys. He's able to kind of step up and, and separate himself from the rest of the pack, and then he delivers. Boy, it's been a real 356, three touchdowns, six carries, 12 yards. Yeah. Let's go ahead and get into... That analysis. We'll see you soon for another edition of NCAA Football 14. That wasn't as close as the other ones, but hey, you know, we'll take a solid W. So game stats, play of stats. Okay, now Mitchell, 24, 29, 356, three touchdowns. Oh, yeah, the punter <laughs> converted that first down. Rushing, 22 for Washington, 21 for Johnson, 12 for Mitchell. Matthews, 12. Ranking four, receiving 122 by Justin Johnson. Way to break out, two touchdowns. 70 for Price, 45 for Washington, 38 for Dixon, 19 for Jennings, 15 for Matthews, Brumfield, 32, Jackson, 27, Bowen, four. Defensive is where we made it up, boys. Two sacks by David Wise left in. We had two picks, one by Akeem Peters, one by Jamal Parker. And the solos were led by Dalton Hicks, who I usered. And he had two tackles for loss. 42 to 24 is the final score. We beat down another top 25 team. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all later.